Hello and welcome to a brand new LP of Red Faction. Yes, I'm doing Red Faction and I... I'm... Yeah, I'm cowering out a bit. I'm being a bit of a pussy, honestly. I'm not doing it on hard. You're thinking, you can forget that, because it is really, really hard on hard. It put it this way, oh, to a certain point, you can you can get pretty well, you can get through it pretty well without having much trouble. But when you get near to the end, they throw the just, oh, it's so brutal to you right at the end. I just cannot get through there on hard on my own, without at least, do I have done it hard on hard, but last time I tried it, it took me a good amount of, like, quick save and all this kind of stuff to get through it and I don't want to put you through that honestly because that'll just make the video go on to like 100 so that's why anyway secondly this is in widescreen as you can see it's running in 1080 even better um, I'm using a third party uh, patch slash mod I think it was uh, called pure faction 3.0 it's on steam forums and it's available on the web just search for pure faction and it just fixes a few of the problems and it allows well, it in for widescreen uh, the only thing I've noticed I can get is um, the subtitles for the messages but it that's about it really right we're gonna go and do the training room anyway first so it's always fun Okay, Parker, this is the training phase of your Red Faction probationary period. If you survive, you'll be ready to help lead the Minor Rebellion against Altar when the time comes. Some doors open as you approach. Others, like this airlock door, require you to press a button to open. If the button doesn't work, the door is locked. You'll have to find the access card or control to unlock it. Keep an eye on your suit's gauges, which are in the upper left corner of your HUD. The outer ring is your suit's integrity. If it gets to zero, you suffer damage when you're outside. The inner ring is your health. When it gets to zero, you're dead. The old talk corporation. Hmm, rings a bell that. I'm not sure where from. <laughs> Practice climbing on the fence, girders, and ladder in your Enviro suit. Yeah, it's, there's a little bit of like weird gravity as well with this. You, you get a bit of a nice long. There's a little bit lower gravity, which is nice. Get used to that sound. You'll hear alarms a lot once we strike back at Altor. Yes, we will hear that a lot. Step into the security control room to learn how to use a monitor. Um, they're surprisingly a little bit handy, the monitors, for certain areas. Yeah, some of them will turn and some won't. I can't control the turning movement on them. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the keyboard. Yeah, there's me! Look, you can see me! Sorry, fanboy. <laughs> you know, running tests on this, I have only noticed one time when I had a little issue. Surprisingly, when I'm using high high amounts of explosives, it will drop to 50 uh, frames. That's about it. <laughs> Pretend the barrels are guards and take them out with this turret. Die barrels. Nothing more to shoot here, Parker. Keep moving. Yeah, unfortunately, turrets have uh, ammo on them. Hmm. There's a medic in the room to your right. Medics are sworn to heal anyone, even rebels. Go to the medic, and he'll bandage your wounds. You'll feel better in no time. There we go. See, 100. Yay! ever need to hide a body, pick it up, carry it somewhere out of the way, and dump it. Who left this here? What me? I can't believe I have to clean someone else's mess up. Do you know? People, you'd think, yeah, it's, <coughs> as a nice satisfying dump, uh, you know, fud noise. <laughs> yeah, but seriously, you'd think people would be able to clean up after themselves. If you've been injured or your suit's been damaged, check containers, medical cabinets, and lockers for med packs and suit repair kits. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Yeah, weirdly enough, uh, it's weird, but um, action is bound originally to enter. I had to change that straight away. It's on E now. <laughs> so much easier. <laughs> Looks like this door is broken. Crouch to get underneath it. Crouch is on C. Control doesn't actually do anything, unless it's uh, for the guns, maybe. Practice jumping across this small gap. Like a boss. Sorry. <laughs> I just got some dialogue there, I should have said some other stuff. Ask nicely, and the miner will open the door for you. I want to tap on the glass. Go right on through, Parker. Like the sub? We stole it from Altar. Climb in and take it for a ride, in case you have to drive a vehicle after we launch the revolt. We are in a technically like a um, environment suit, so it, I guess it stands to reason that it'll have an air suppression system and all that kind of stuff. So you can use underwater. But there's water on Mars! Oh, wow! Sorry. Fire some torpedoes to get a feel for it. One of my favourite things for the uh, Red Faction engine. Destructible environment. Oh, good stuff. I could spend it... I, I literally, when I had this on the uh, PlayStation... Up here. Head through the other tunnel when you're ready to continue. Could have been the PS2, I can't remember which one this were on. I spent for ages shooing out bits of rock. It It's very satisfying, honestly. <laughs> Except for the ammo count, anyway. You only get 20 rounds. But that can't remember if you get unlimited when you uh, finally do use something like this. Climb out of the sub and go up the stairs. You can park this very nicely, though. Look. They don't mind you parking it up rightwards. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, I think there's some. I don't know if there's some lower gravity or what in effect, but it's kind of nice. Open the gun cabinet and grab the pistol and sniper rifle. The gauge in the upper right of your HUD shows how much ammo you have left. Most of these all have secondary fire. Come on, let me in. Sometimes it pays to be inconspicuous. Holstering your weapon will help you blend in, since guns make people jumpy. Here. Yep. H to holster. Very handy. Take some target practice here. Be sure to destroy all the bottles. Okay. Uh, we'll use the uh, pistol. It's very accurate, the pistol, actually. Uh, at this range, it is, anyway. A bit further out, you want to use a sniper rifle. Sniper's pretty nice, though. You get a ton of ammo as well for it. Nothing more to shoot here, Parker. Keep moving. Yeah, I've just wiped out the ball nation. Open up your message log and scroll through the mess. Yeah, message log. Yeah, I can. If you really that bothered, I can put this up now and then, I guess. But it, yeah, this is all the text that should be at the top. This log automatically records messages that you receive. Man, they only get breakfast for an hour? Ah. Reinforced glass is unbreakable. Go ahead. Shoot it. Hold on. Hold on. Let me turn my silencer off. Shame. Oh. Vicious little lid. Normal glass can be shattered by weapon fire, allowing you into the room beyond. Wait, if this is a training zone for the Red Faction, I, I feel f sorry for the posse that has to keep on replacing all these windows all the time. <laughs> Especially all the demolition work as well. Use, the use these to blow a hole in the wall at the X. Okay. Hmm, still satisfying. There we go. Uh, it's not big enough for me yet. Wow, it's indestructible. There we go. There we go. Now I have full room to get through. Yeah, it, it's li ridiculous, this. I could be at this all day, honestly. Like I said, I feel sorry for the boss that has to rebuild this entire thing. Because I could be here all day doing this. I really could. <laughs> 
Jeez, man, that floor's indestructible. Yeah, unfortunately you can't place multiple satchel charges. Which is a shame, admittedly, but... You can cause a nice, very nice damage. Look, the, it's just the door frame now. <laughs> Sorry, can't resist. Congratulations, you've passed the Red Faction training session. Even the top of this is a... Uh, rubble. Uh. Mars. I always thought of it as a romantic place, a planet of mystery and adventure. Came here six months ago thinking it would be an escape from Earth. I wanted some time to think, to figure out what to do with my life. A year in the Altor mine sounded like a great way to straighten myself out. Man, was I a fool. Life in the mines is hell. I haven't had a minute to myself since I got here. You're jammed eight to a room, time sharing your bunks. Conditions are barely livable. And the guards are everywhere. Altor doesn't care if we live or die. We're at the breaking point. And then there's the plague killing off miners left and right. When the guy next to you dies before your eyes and your turn could come any minute, it freaks you out. No one knows what causes it or how to cure it. Or at least the miners don't know. Someone named Eos is putting up pamphlets in the barracks, claiming that Ultor is responsible for the plague. The pamphlets urge miners to be ready to revolt against Ultor. A lot of miners are muttering, but nothing's come of it yet. As bad as things are in the barracks, they're brutal down in the mines. You spend ten hours drenched in your own sweat in the Enviro suit, grinding away at rock walls. The guards make sure you work the whole shift. They enjoy their work way too much. You get out of the driller after your shift's over and all you've done is dig yourself in a little deeper. Don't know how long I can keep doing this. Second work shift has ended. Miners return to barracks. Parker, shift's over. Hey, where do you think you're going? Leave me alone, jerk. It's been a long day. It's about to get a little longer, mine scum. Just let me go, or else. You threatening me? Yeah, well, threaten this! Hi, miner. Ah! Oh. Ah! Come on, die. There we go. Disturbance in Mine Sector M4. Code Yellow Alert. Like I said, long range of pistols absolute garbage, but if you get like mid range, it's quite nice. Hmm. Let's have a quick peek around here for any uh, explosives. You've got to always get explosives and water down there. Now, I know there's an off limit area, and I've went up there once, and it's kind of like almost bogus. I think it's up here, actually. Nope. Just you and me, miner. Oh. Mm. Ah, here we go. Explosives. Yeah, there's plenty of health around for the time being. Just you and me, miner. Oh. See what I mean? Sometimes this thing can be so accurate, and then sometimes it's absolute garbage. Additional security <laughs> required. Just you and me, miner. Oh. Oh. Can we try the silencer on it again? Oh. Well, maybe it's a bit so, uh, oh. more accurate with the silencer on it. Ah, more explosives. Good. I like it when they pay me in explosives. Aha, is this the right room? Hey, get over here. We're with the Red Faction. Good. Stick yes. 
We're heading to the Red Faction base. I love the ones with the uh Oh, thank you. you. Got me a rocket launcher. Miners, this is Eos, leader of the Red Faction. Our time has Ready come. Ready to make it. Workers in mine M4 have started the rebellion. They're fighting and dying for you as I speak. Find the Red Faction members among you. Join us and strike back at Altor. Together, we all miners are able to ignore unauthorized announcements and return to their barracks immediately. Hmm. <laughs> Very good. Uh, anything you've left me? Ah, another rocket launcher. Good. Hey, it's good ammo. <laughs> so, yes, the pistol is a little bit more accurate with the silencer on, which is kind of irritating. Um, stun baton. It actually has a stun function. You have a normal swing, and then you have like a stun actual stunner move, which is great. <laughs> I know it's during the cutscene actually that, that um, one of the shots the Pope was actually of, help, of help. like a, the the uh, thing really zoomed in uh, the cursor. Thanks. Hey, come with me. A bunch of miners are heading up to the docking bay to steal the shuttle. They're gonna get off Mars and back to Earth. You help me reach the shuttle, and I'll make sure they take you along. Okay. Hold on, though. I think it, is it down here? Oh, I don't know. Where did you come from? Oh well, I don't know where he came from him then. <laughs> ah, oops, sorry buddy. Oh, ow. I mean, I'm paying attention. Yeah, it's like, because they're not using the... Uh, you're not unarmed. Lion bastard. Where are you two come from? Code red alert in mine M4. Security level two response required. I'll forget it. Yeah, one of them can't hit for shit, and the other ones uh, still can't hit for shit. Oh, come on! Oh, dead on. There we go. Oh, the other one did hit him. Good. I've had one of them kill himself before, which is kind of funny. <laughs> um, okay, what is wrong with these uh, uh, these NPCs? Yeah, I'm after some uh, Evo suits. Oh, I don't know. I've got health, at least. Somewhat. <laughs> them rocket launchers, man. <laughs> hey, you take whatever you can use, can't you? I guess when it comes down to it. What more music? To Better run, miner. Oh. 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 I can't wait to get the assault rifle. Oh. Pistol's okay, but it's uh, eh, well, it's mid range. Well, assault rifle can now that can get some range. Especially like when you're aiming for the head, you hit his shoulder twice. In mine and four. Security level one response required. Red faction. Who said my name? <laughs> no, I'm Parker. You haven't guessed yet, by the way. Um, I don't think there's much. There's some of fall damage, but not for much. Hold it, the hell? Oh, yeah, yeah, I think they keep on respawning for a while in this area, actually. I have a weird feeling about that, actually. Yeah, I'll do it. Oh, wait, I could have left some sexual charge for him, couldn't I? Well. <laughs> Ah, oh, whatever. Stop complaining. Give up, miner. Oh, oh. To die. oh. Stop saying that. You're making me feel bad. 
Uh, I don't think there's anything in this crusher room. Yeah, you know, you can actually stick rubble... You can blow this roof up a bit and stick rubble in and it'll actually crush it down. 